ready with me while I trauma dump on you. So I was born in Russia and I would think it's an hour of trauma already, but it's just the beginning. I don't have parents. Well, obviously I did have parents at some point I was born, but my mom left my dad and myself when I was a year and a half or so and she just disappeared. I started living with my dad's mom because my dad had kidney problems and he had to be in the hospital six days out of seven so he couldn't raise me obviously so I started living with his mom. My dad died when I was seven years old and my mom came back to my life when I was probably nine. I guess she felt guilty and she was trying to give money to my grandma and she took it obviously duh but we didn't really connect with her so she disappeared again when i was 13 well she didn't disappear we just stopped talking All my life my grandma have been telling me that it's not important for women to make a lot of money because there's men for that even though her husband died when she was 45 and she'd been working three jobs since then because she had to support me and her. All my life I wanted to be the actor or director or journalist, but my grandma was trying to put myself into medical school and I hated it. So I finished high school when I was 16 and at 16 I supposed to decide who I want to be all my life and that didn't go well so i wanted to go to acting school but my grandma told me get a real degree first and when i'm free to do whatever i want that's a trap that's a trap all parents tell their kids so i chose political science and very quick i realized russia and shit and it was 2009 and look at me now i was right anyway in 2011 my grandma offered me to go to work and travel program to usa and i think she still regret her decision 13 years later you'll ask me why i think she regret it well because i stayed here and never came back now 13 years later i am working on my traumas i have beautiful amazing husband and three cats and the bills from psychologist